this is courtesy of complex and this is regarding um jerry lorenzo of fear of god essentially shutting down the rumors that this particular shoe that got leaked online is going to be part of his collaboration with adidas that we still haven't seen so this shoe that's featured here down below that i'm going to show you i think it's a white let's see if it pops up here is it going to pop up please do so i can show people what i'm talking about are you going to pop up or not maybe it's not going to pop up but it's basically yeah, there we go so this shoe was leaked online and people were basically wrongly assuming that this is going to be um jay lorenzo's debut shoe or part of his debut collection at adidas and he was quickly to come out to shut it down and say this is not anything to do with him and i was happy to hear that because when i initially saw these i felt they looked very uninspired i thought they looked very dated it looked like a design that he probably should have put out a few years ago or maybe should have put out at the time that he got announced as you know um somebody that was going to be working with adidas in the basketball capacity that would have made sense but they also kind of looked too similar to stuff that he did at nike beforehand it wasn't that much of an upgrade over the or of a kind of you know it wasn't much of an upgrade or differential from that stuff and it also looked a lot like that um yeezy basketball sneaker that kanye made um you know a, few, a couple of years ago that's been popular for a while so i wasn't really too happy about these so it's good to know that they're not his shoe but it does kind of raise the question what is going on with jerry lorenzo and adidas like what was the delay my sensible brain non-conspiratorial brain wants to say it was because of the pandemic the pandemic happened and then kanye west leaving and all these other things happening in between with the business and the ceo changing kind of put a pause on him because jerry lorenzo is a big deal and fear of god's a big deal they probably want to put a lot of money into promoting it so they probably put a pause on all big you know drops and whatnot um that they wanted to put out there so that might have been a reason why but also i'm wondering if maybe they kind of got him involved decided to kind of get him involved because they wanted to tell that story of jerry lorenzo and fear of god but they also wanted to do it in tandem with having yeezy you know as part of their flipping um array of products that ends and obviously kanye has a falling out with ADS and that goes and goes where it goes and now you're left with a guy who you maybe didn't want on his own you went to maybe have it in tandem with ga he then shows you some of the stuff he's been working on and you just think it's not hitting it's not the one it's not what you wanted and it's not maybe good enough yet for production and maybe ADS is one that says hey now we're not putting this out this is not good enough and it's time to go back to the drawing board maybe i'm not really too sure but it's a bit weird how it's taken so long it feels like it's been more than two years so far but let's read the article because of complex it says after jerry lorenzo confirmed a new direction for adidas um partnership last fall fans have been eager to see what's next from the designer sneaker collaborations with the new leaks making the round today um to learn to shared more details exclusively with complex he says that is not the basketball sneaker for fear of god and adidas lorenzo said in today's leak adding that the fear of god adidas performance sneaker um, and race rate collection will be officially unveiled on april 19th so in a couple of weeks we'll be able to see that during the hollywood bowl showing of fear of god's eighth collection which is great I'm, i love the fact that he's doing his first runway collection in hollywood in la and not doing it in paris or something um because he's actually from there that's pretty cool the sneaker in question surface today in instagram the images show a mid-cut design in black and cream with a four foot strap and three stripes branding on the toe the field go branding on the heel beneath the adidas trophy logo the leak shoe is cushioned with the adidas light strike foam light strike foam sorry while the shoe picture isn't here isn't part of the collection readers can expect to see the anticipated fear of god link up next month so yeah what is happening with adidas and fear of god um did they just realize that he maybe isn't as good as they probably hoped he was did he get cold feet is it an easy thing i'm not really too sure but the reaction from everyone online was that these were terrible and he had to come out and clear it up so whatever does drop in april needs to be really really hard and a real departure from these if he's if, if it'll be really hilarious if um what's his name if um jay lorenzo ends up debuting this shoe at the hollywood bowl show and it's just the same shoe with just the stripes removed or something that would be hilarious if that ends up happening i don't think it does because if anything when i look at this shoe it kind of looks at like something that was designed when he initially signed the deal so it may be the first sort of like prototype or model that they kind of specced up but i wouldn't imagine someone like him would be happy to put this out 
in this year considering how dated it kind of looks as a design and shape and considering what he's done prior as well and of course considering what people have mentioned here already in the chat about the yeezy quantum i think it's not called the basketball it's called a quantum so yeah they look too similar to that regard so i think he wouldn't want to tell that story again in his own way i think he wants them to do something fresh you would imagine so but yeah no to show what's happening with joe lorenzo i'm hoping it's just like you know normal life stuff and the pandemic got in a way and things got delayed but it's not a really good sign that they've taken so long with such a high profile person to put anything out and we still haven't got any idea on what the shoe looks like it's been really under wraps either it's been really done either it's not been designed at all or it's been legitimately put super super under wraps and no one has any idea on what exactly it's going to end up looking like when it does eventually come out we don't know yet but we're gonna have to wait and see i guess when it does eventually drop we'll have to wait and see when it does eventually drop.